an apology for using a computer to speak for me but an illness has not allowed me to make recordings lately. Plus I'm working on a new recording studio to get better sound from microphones. I wanted to let you know that soon I will make a video about three subwoofers that are part of a 5.1 equipment each with its own amplifier for the subwoofer and its satellite speakers. The first one is an Alltech leasing Dell that will be very easy to make it work with other devices but anyway we will go deep inside to see its guts. We will also see a very rare Spherix branded subwoofer created especially for the Xbox 360 and requires an external control to work but we will see how we can make it work without its remote control. And finally we will see a Bose subwoofer that came in an Acoustim S25 Series 2 home theater and requires an external equipment to work. We will also make it work without its external equipment so that we can use it with any other equipment. In addition I have almost finished a video that is part of a series that teach us the basics of sound equipment to be able to understand its operation and know how to adapt it to other equipment and even adapt it to different needs like making a home subwoofer to work in a car and vice versa. It is not as simple as putting a converter in the car from 12 volts to 120 for it to work properly. And also being able to put a 200 watt or more amplifier at home is not as simple as using a computer power source for supplying the amplifier with power. There are much more efficient ways of getting each of these equipment to adapt more naturally to another environment. In the second part of these videos we will see how the power sources either linear or switching to operate these amplifiers in environments for which they were not designed. Thank you.